Hello everyone, welcome to Unlock Maths. Today we have to find Laplace transform of this function, right? So here we have to write down this function f of t as this is e raised to minus a t minus e raised to minus b t by t, right? Now we can check that here we have this function divided by t. That means we have to apply here effect of division by t, yes? So first we have to find Laplace transform of this numerator, right? So Laplace of e raised to minus a t minus e raised to minus b t, yes? What is this Laplace? Yes, we can apply linearity property and we can find separately Laplace of this function. So here we can write this is as, yes, now what is the Laplace of this is 1 upon s plus a minus 1 upon this s plus b, right? Yes, we have find Laplace of this. Now we want Laplace of this e raised to minus a t minus e raised to minus b t by t, right? Yes, we have divided this function by t. That means here we have to apply effect of division by t, yes? And what is that effect? Yes, we have to take integral of this Laplace, right? And this integral is within limit as to infinity. So here we have integral of this Laplace. This is 1 upon s plus a minus 1 upon s plus b, yes? And this integration with respect to s, right? Now, yes, we have to solve this integral, right? Now we can check that here we have the standard form of this function. This is here 1 upon x plus a integration with respect to x and this is here we know that this is log of x plus a, right? Or yes, we can find by this formula also, yes. This is log of f of x function having its derivative in numerator, right? Yes. So here we have this is log of s plus a minus log of s plus b, right? And this is within limit s to infinity. Yes, we have find the integral. Now we have to put the limit. Yes, we have find this integral with respect to s. That means this is the limit of s, right? So here, when we put limit, we will get this is log of infinity, right? And log of infinity is infinity, right? Yes, that means when we put limit of s, this Laplace get infinite, right? So to get finite Laplace, yes, we will adjust these terms as, yes, by log rule here we can write this is as a log of s plus a upon s plus b, right? This is within limit s to infinity, yes. Now, yes, can we write this is here by taking this s common? So here we have 1 plus this is a by s and same on this is here by taking s common from this s plus b so here we have s into 1 upon this is b by s yes this is s to infinity right now we can cancel out this s s here so what we have remaining here this is log of 1 plus a by s and 1 plus b by s now we can check that, can we put limit here, can we get a finite Laplace, yes here when we put this infinity, s is equals to infinity here, so we have here this is a upon infinity and constant upon infinity that is 0, right, that means we will get here finite Laplace, right. So now we have to put the limit, yes, when we put here s is equals to infinity, so here we have this is 1 upon this is a by infinity, right, same here, this is 1 plus 
this is by b by infinity right and for upper limit upper limit this is we have to put s is equals to s right this that means that is as it is right yes we have put limit here now yes what we are finding here this is the laplace of e raised to minus a t minus e raised to minus b t by t right now yes this is a by infinity that is 0 right that means here we have this is log of this is 1 plus 0 and same here this is 1 plus 0 and this is as this is yes this term as it is now if we want we can simplify this is again here this is s plus a upon s and here this is s plus b upon s right and this is log of 1 plus 0 that means log 1 and we know what is the value of log 1 yes this is 0 and now on simplification of this is yes this s's get cancelled right so remaining here we have this is log of s plus a and s plus b right log 1 is 0 so here we have this is so by again log rule we can write this is as yes this is log of s plus b upon s plus a yes right and we have find laplace of this function here yes this is the required laplace which we have find by effect of division by t right so what we have done here first we have find laplace of this is then we have apply effect of division by t yes by this effect we have to take integral of this laplace right so in this way we have to proceed for finding laplace so yes, that's it for now. See you in the next video. Thank you. Keep watching.